In this tutorial, you will learn how to make these radar graph in Microsoft Excel. You can see here that I have made three different type of radar chart. In first chart, I have recorded the student performance. And you can see here that I did not use marker in this graph. And separate line is used to record the performance of each student. You can easily see that um, these students are weak in history and biology, while their performance is good in math and physics. In second graph, I have uh, used three different treatments of a food products and they are stored at five different temperature. I have uh, recorded the, the taste of all these treatments in the same line and this graph look like spider web. So these graphs are also called spider web chart. In third graph, I have recorded the rainfall during 12 months in area, area radar chart. So let's uh, start this tutorial. So first graph is the student performance and there are three students and their performance in different subjects uh, is given in this chart. So select this data. Go to insert tab and select radar chart it is uh, surface and radar so it is without marker and it is with marker drag this here and resize it here different chart styles are available you can use this and you can change its color from here and here quick layouts of these charts are available so i will start formatting using plus sign axis title chart title is okay data label i don't want data labels and that's okay firstly write chart title student performance Click enter, go to home and change its color and font size to 18. Next I uh, format this legend, right click, format legend and here I will select right. Legend appear here, I will change its font size to 12 and black color. Next, I will uh, format these data label, these labels. So, 12 and bold. You can change the color of these lines. Here you can change the color. This one. So it become more visible. You can also change uh, these axis label I will change its axis option to 4 minimum value you will see here that this value will be changed currently it is selected 0 as minimum value so it is changed now You can also change the uh, font size and here you can see that if you want tick marks or labels or number and uh, format you can change this 12 and bold black color sorry and uh, next I will change the color of these lines go to fill option and here you can see you can change this color you can even have different option regarding the width of the lines and their type select second one and change its color to green and select third one 
change its color to purple uh, and we have completed the formatting of this graph you can see it looks quite good so next we start second graph and we shape it like spider web select this one remember that uh, you should not write here uh, in this cell anything so select here these are different treatments and storage intervals and their test score of food product is recorded here select this data go to insert tab and in this option select radar chart with markers firstly drag it here use handles to resize it select these axis go to home black and 12 and go to here axis option minimum value of 4 because you can see in data that minimum value is 4 here major you can uh, select major unit or minor unit 4 to 8 I will select major unit as 1 select this data and change its color of this line to somewhere here it's become more visible from major grid line you can select an option of radar value axis and here you can select solid line you can see a different lines uh, like spider web appeared here you can also change this font size and its color now you can format this series line option and change its color to this one you can also change the uh, marker color and their style as well select this one this line and in fill option you find here marker and you can uh, if you select here fill option of marker or border or its type you will find these option from this menu so last thing uh, I will change its title taste score of food product you can easily uh, demonstrate the data regarding the taste score of food product you can see a treatment t1 and storage interval s1 has this value and s2 has this value similarly treatment to t2 s1 has this value and so it's, uh, it's quite easy to figure out the score of taste and so next uh, we will move to third graph it is a uh, graph regarding the rainfall uh, uh, in different in, in different month select this go to insert tab and select radar chart with area radar chart firstly we will uh, form without marker then with marker then this area radar chart if you want to conditionally format then first change its title 
rainfall in Karachi. Press enter, go to home and change its color and font size. You can also change this one. You can also change the series option. Next, we uh, change the color of these lines. If you want to uh, firstly change this color, then we will explore further option. This one, so it become somewhat more visible. Then go to here, and if you select solid fill, then these lines will be appeared on this. If you select on this, you can even change its color according to your requirement. So you can even uh, give 3D shapes by using these shadow, glow or soft edges option. There are plenty of options available you can use according to your data requirement or your graph requirement. So that's end of this, this tutorial. Thanks for watching this tutorial. Goodbye.